Right, in order to solve this quadratic equation, use a quadratic formula. Um, the first step we need to do is to set the uh, equation equal to zero. And that's because the quadratic formula here requires that you set it equal to zero. And what it does, it takes the coefficients of the non-zero side, um, a being the lead coefficient. In this case, a is 3. Um, the b coefficient is negative 1. And the c coefficient is 5. And all we need to do is to plug those values into uh, this quadratic formula here. And so we'll get that uh, x or w in this case. w equals negative b, which would just be 1 plus or minus the square root b squared, which is 1 minus 4 times 3 times 5 all over 2 times a, which is 3. Okay, so we just plug all those values in, and then just simplify the radical um, and its expression as much as possible, so we get a 1, or 1 plus or minus the square root. Uh, doing all that math gives me negative 59, all over 6, and really the only trick now is uh, I'm going to pull out that negative in the square root um, and use i, to get 1 plus or minus i square root 59 over 6, and uh, this here should be my final answer.